Welcome to another episode of Are Your Designs Any Good? Introducing Are Your Designs Any Good with Shimmy Morris. I love, I love it. I love that intro. It's just such a good intro. Anyway, I don't want to bore you. I want to get straight into designs. I've just got two things to say. One, if you haven't already subscribed, then please hit that subscribe button. I would really appreciate it. And also it just helps me you know, continue making all these videos. And two, if you wanna get involved and have your design critiqued by me, then the link is in the description down below. All right, I think that's it, let's get on with it. I'm going to be um, basing these designs off three criteria: what I think of the design, what marketing I think would work with your design, and the improvements I think you should make to your design if there are any improvements. So let's start with design number one. All right, I've got my screen recording here, This this should be good. The first design, bongs. Okay, I mean, it's 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 a cool design. Not 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 for me, not my personal taste. But um, no judgments here. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Uh, it's, it's it's a cool design. Um, what I would do is I'll change the color of the bongs to something else. Um, you've got a lot of colors going on here. You've got green. You've got what looks like red. You've got purple. You've got a light gray. You've got a dark gray. Then you've got another gray. You've got black. You've got a lot of colors going on. Um, I would also uh, no, you know, we'll talk about improvements later. I'll tell you what I like about it. Um, I like that the two bongs have little faces that are like, I guess, high. Um, and I like the, the font of the bongs word. It's like that kind of cloudy font. Now, in terms of who you would target, I guess you would target people who are into smoking up. I don't know how easy that is. I mean, you could have an entire Instagram page about, you know, bongs and weed and all that kind of stuff and, 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 and everything related to that. And you'll get quite a lot of followers. Um, but um, but I'm just trying to think because targeting this is going to be really hard. It's going to be really hard because also a lot of a lot of places won't want to have ads running for a t-shirt like this. So you've got to bear that in mind as well. And then in terms of improvement, um, I think the, the idea is okay, but I think the execution can be so much better. The font and the wording and the actual bongs, they could, it could all be placed a lot better. Um, for example, one of the bongs can be the O or something, I don't know. Like, yeah, the round bottom of the, the, the bong can be the O and then the top bit can just be the bong bit. Um, I feel like it could be done a bit better, so rethink your design of it, but it's a pretty, it's a pretty interesting one. Right, moving on. Oh gosh, it's a hefty design. Conquer the gym, discover yourself. This is very Illuminati with the fingers and the triangle and the, the lines and... Okay, well, firstly, I like the font. I like the, the, the wording, conquer the gym, discover yourself. I like the graphics, the graphics is cool, right? Um, in terms of who you would target, I guess you would target people who go to the gym, gym lovers, you know, people who like to work out, people into fitness. Targeting is not a problem because also there are tons and tons of Instagram pages that you can actually, you know, promote this kind of t-shirt on. Um, in terms of improvements, I don't like how it's just a big block image, you know, a big square image on, on a jumper. Um, I'm never really a fan of those unless it's from like one of the big companies and the image is like a significant moment in time or something. It's like a, a, a like a momentous moment on like a t-shirt. But usually I would, I would never really go for something like this. Also, you've got like a ribbon there where there's nothing writing in the ribbon. So why is the ribbon there? You've also got too many colors. You've got black writing, white writing, you've got black ribbon, you've got a lightly colored red ribbon, you've got a red background, you've got a, a, a harsh white triangle. You've then got this high graphic of fingers with, it's just too much. I mean, look, what I would say is my improvements here is use the phrase conquer the gym, discover yourself, but change the whole design because the design I don't think is gonna get very far. Moving on. Let me drown in your arms. Okay, this might be something that goes over my head. I like the font. I like the 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 purple. It's quite hard to read. The um the skull and the woman is is a cool picture. I mean, it's it, it. I don't know why he's dead. Let me drown in your arms. I guess drown. You die when you drown. So maybe that. I don't know. Maybe this is a sentence. Let me know in the comments if this means something to you. But um. It's a cool idea. I have no idea who you would target just because I don't really understand the design. And in terms of improvements, um, the only thing I'm thinking is it's slightly difficult to read the dark purple with white on the black t-shirt. I find it's quite hard. You might find it easy to read if the t-shirt was white um, and the font wasn't as squiggly. But other than that, it, it's, it's a pretty cool design. 
Right. Guitar on board. This is cute. I like this. I like this a lot. So this can be for a kid. It can be for an adult. I would probably aim this more at children rather than adults. Um, I like the it's like I like the whole sign. It's very cool. I might personally change the guitar on board. I would say change it to white, not black on yellow. But um, the whole the whole thing. It's a very cool signpost. You could even have like a stick maybe, but you probably don't even need a stick. You know what? No, it's good. It's good. I like this design. I really do. And um, in terms of the targeting, I guess you just target musicians, right? Target guitarists of all sorts, bass, acoustic, electric, uh, ukulele, anything, right? But maybe stick to just the guitars, not ukulele. Um, you, you, it's endless who you can target here. You've got a lot of targeting in terms of Pinterest, Instagram, you know, Etsy, whatever, maybe Facebook ads. You can target a lot of people. Um, but in terms of improvements, like I said, I would probably say you know, maybe change the letter, try it in white, see what it looks like, and also maybe move it up a tiny bit so it's nearer the neckline. But other than that, I think it's a cool design. I like it. Well done. I only smoke tires. Ooh, this is cool. So this is basically saying I don't smoke, I smoke tires because I race, I go fast, I do burnouts, whatever it may be. And that's cool. The only thing is um, you've got weird colors going on here but i'm gonna to get to that in a minute so what i do like is i like the phrase i only smoke tires it's a cool phrase i like that in terms of who you target you target car nuts you target people like me car enthusiasts petrol heads uh people who like racing people who like burnouts people who like donuts that kind of thing not those kind of donuts um but yeah you'll target those kind of people and then in terms of what to improve well i like the font i like the boldness what i don't like is the gray on orange i don't think it goes and also it's not centered very well it could just be the angle that the t-shirt's at but i don't think it's centered then again you could do better with the tires i don't like that um i also don't like the 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 fire that's coming out of the tire i think it's very graphic-y and it's been it looks like it's been cut out on clip art really badly but what you could do is you could try and make this design a bit more interesting so take the phrase i only smoke tires and maybe like the the, the o in only and the o in smoke could be burning tires like a, a tire with like burn like like smoke coming up billowing up from it that could be cool and then that's all you pretty much need right i only smoke tires something like that that's that 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 would be in my mind quite a good a good idea okay moving on to the next one i'm getting through quite a lot of designs for this one that's quite good wow okay sorry i was just shocked by the amount of copyright that's being blown into my face like copyright copyright you've got the beatles logo there you've got while well, my guitar gently weeps is that a name of one of their songs um let me double check this i think it is while my guitar gently weeps while my guitar is a song by the beatles i thought so i knew it was a song right so many copyright laws i'm not even going to bother doing this because i feel like having this Odd my channel is going to put a copyright infringement on this video, but basically you, you don't you can't design. I'm not even gonna bother going into it. I can't breathe and then skulls with a face mask thingy, um like a gas mask and then a fire. Um is this I can't breathe based on the the whole thing with the Black Lives Matter um you know that whole thing that went on? If it is I don't know why you've got fiery, I can't breathe. He wasn't burnt, um, so that's a bit weird. Um, also, I just don't like the design. I'm sorry, I don't like any of this. I don't know who, you, look, I'll start with this. I don't know who you would target, because like, I, don't, I have no idea who you're targeting. In terms of improvements, scrap the design and move on. And then in terms of what I like, I, I just, I don't like any of it. I'm sorry, it's really creepy. Together. Hashtag together, sorry. Uh, this is cool. Um, I actually really like this. I really, really like this. I like the the graphic is a really, really cool little graphic of the two hands. I like the hashtag together over it and the font of the... I like this a lot. I really, really, really like this. The only concern I have here is that I don't know who you would target. Um, it's hard figuring out who you would target. I guess you could target movements, black and white movements, stuff like that. Um, but this is the type of thing that is probably sold in stools or shops, not sold online, because it's it's going to be quite hard to figure out who to target here. And in terms of improvements, I wouldn't make any improvements. I really like it. And I also like, I don't know if you realize, but how the two uh, hands have taken the shape of like a heart. So that's really, really nice as well. I really like that design. 
All right, we've got time for a few more designs. Um, stop me if you can, follow me if you can't. Ah, I get it. All right, it took me a couple of seconds to actually get this. Right, this is cool. This is cool. Um, basically, she's saying, you know, if, stop me if you... If, try and stop me if you can, and if you can't stop me, then join me, basically. Um, this is... It's cool design. I like that you used, you know, just, just two fonts, and it's all congruent with each other. It's all very neat. It's all very nice. It's all in line. It's done very, very well. So well done for that. Hats off to you. In terms of who you would target, I don't know who you would target. I'm going to be honest. I, I don't know who you would target. Maybe you would target athletes, entrepreneurs, people like that, people who are very m driven to do something and usually get trodden on and they're like, look, if you can't stop me, then join me. Um, it's kind of like that famous saying, um, if you can't beat them, join them. So it's, it's basically a twist on that. So yeah, it's very, very cool. And in terms of improvements, I wouldn't really make improvements. I really do like this design. I think it's really, really cool. I'm liking this episode, you know. There's a lot of good designs in this episode. I'm very happy with this episode. All right, next one. Um, procrastination queen. Um, okay, I can imagine this being cool in a t-shirt. You've got two fonts, so you haven't gone overboard with the fonts. I like the font of the queen and the procrastination. I like the little... Uh, uh, crown um in terms of who you would target no idea no idea in terms of improvements i would say improvements would be just to try and niche down a bit and be a bit more targeted but the actual design i think it's quite a cool little design i like it it's cute it would look good on the top of the t-shirt or it would look cool on the back of the t-shirt so that when you're trying to work people can see are actually not working right i think this is going to be the last one for this episode um and i'm going to I don't know why I'm looking at here. This is a very, very, very colourful turtle. Or tortoise. Turtle? Tortoise? I'm going to go with turtle. Um, okay, we'll start with this. All right, so in terms of design, I like the design. It's really cute. It's really cool. I like the colours. You might struggle to um, find a print on demand company that will um, be happy with all these colours. Um, but other than that, it, it's quite a cool little design. In terms of targeting, I guess you would target animal lovers, people who like turtles, tur tur turtles, turtoises, tur it's a hard one, that animal, isn't it? You would target people who like turtles or tortoises. Um, so yeah, that's your targeting done. And you can have a whole Instagram page about that. It could be a bit boring, but people like it. And then in terms of improvements, you know, I don't really think you need that many improvements. I kind of like it. I like the paint splatter with the turtle on it. Um, I don't really get it. I don't see the connection. But it is cool. Right, that is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you, I hope your design was in it. If it wasn't in it, I just want you to know it will be in the next one. So don't panic. I'm doing these every single week on Saturday. So I just want to say thank you so, so much for watching. Again, if you haven't liked, you haven't subscribed, then what are you waiting for? Hit that like button, hit the subscribe button, and hopefully, hopefully, I'll see you in the next video.